Vlog 5 Ice Skating Salaf Salaf Wie gaat het doen? Hi, I'm Yilis. February 2021. A cold spell hit the Netherlands. After almost a week of constant freezing temperatures, all the lakes and waters were frozen over enough to go ice skating. You should know that the Netherlands is completely crazy about ice skating. Layer on top of that a year-long pandemic with various levels of lockdowns. It felt the whole country went crazy in a celebratory kind of way. The last time we were able to go ice skating on natural ice was January 2013, so there was a lot of pent up demand. This video is mostly a chronological impression across several days of ice skating. Here we entered the Havenrak, the central lake of our village. The Ice Association had cleared out a nice track. On the left you see the great tea house Napoleon seems to have visited in 1811. Yeah, there's a lot of history here. The week before we had lots of wind, which made the parts of the ice that froze up first very very bumpy, like here on the lake. The trick is to find the waters that froze over a few days later. Those were as flat as a pancake.
Here, we are approaching Zuiderwoude, currently housing 320 people, but having a claim to being one of the oldest villages in the country, as it existed back in 863, over 1100 years ago. It has survived a burning by the Spanish in 1573 and multiple floodings in 1825 and 1916. The latter lasted for months. Water in the foreground here is called Kerk Ei. The AE is pronounced Ei and is an old generic word for flowing water. Here we return back to Broek in Waterland from the east. Celebrating an unforgettable weekend with some opera ski drinks over at Het Broeker Huis. The whole weekend felt like a holiday given by Mother Nature in a time we could all use one. Hope you like these impressions. See you in the next one.